ulan. Welcome again to my YouTube channel, Amethyst Lambert Intuitive Psychic, at sa aking Facebook page, Amethyst Intuitive Psychic. And of course, please don't forget to like and go ahead follow me on my Instagram, Amethyst Intuitive Psychic. I am now going to do a cancer video. Cancer zodiac sign po tayo. And these are all created for November 2020. Although, created siya para sa buwan na ito. It doesn't mean na hanggang dito lang to, okay? Anytime mo siya mapanood, kahit kung mali ka pa sa mga dati kong videos, kapag yun ay tumugma sa'yo, it's meant for you. Okay? Because everything happens for a reason. So, um, with that being said, please don't forget to subscribe kung hindi ka pa nakakapag-subscribe. Please like, share, and follow me on my Facebook page as well. Like the video, share, click the send star for donation if you want to support me. And of course, click that notification bell icon sa aking Facebook page at YouTube channel. Okay? Alright, so let's start. Mga cancer yan. Ang aking mga emosyonal na kaibigan dyan. Kamag-anak na cancer yan. Alam mo na ako. Sino yung mga clingy at is may pagka-childlike kind of personality. Ayan na. They're very strong. Okay? Uy, six of swords lang. Parang ang dami sa atin ngayon ang gustong maglakbay kung saan-saan. Bakasyon nito or trabaho. We want to go somewhere else, traveling to different places, making a decision to go abroad or not. Hmm. That's weird. <laughs> Pero three of swords ang iyong mahahat, mahahantungan or naranasan mo na. Three of swords is actually love triangle or options. Being an option. Eight of swords, yan. Diyos ko, ang mga pinagdaan ng kalungkutan, kapigatian. Hindi pa rin makalimutan ang ating cancer yan. But, because of that, you want to move forward and have a lover, a, a partner that will understand your emotions and feelings. Four of so vessels, Diyos ko, yung mga pag-iilasyon na yan. Tigil-tigilan na. Because, if you want to move forward and have a partner who's going to understand and love you, please don't forget to face the reality. Accept the fact of you having pain and hurts and heartaches and heartbreaks and deceptions na pinagdaanan. Then, you can move forward with someone who's going to have the same feeling experiences with you. Diba? Oy, two of swords na hindi mo na kailangan magdalawang isip. Ah, this can be a karmatic effect. Karmic cycle. Meaning to say, kung ano nangyari sa'yo, pwedeng gawin mo rin sa, sa iba. Please do not do it. Kung nasaktan ka man because of people deceiving you, cheating on you, it's not good for you to do it as well to other people. No one deserves that, okay? Be a queen of vessel, a vessel or queen of cups, meaning to say you have to be someone who's more understanding, um, thoughtful, caring, and loving. Just like your mother. Mother-like figure, yun eh. And king of vessels, ooh, if you are going to be a queen of vessels, you're meant to be with a king of vessels. Or if you're a king of vessels, you're meant to be with queen of vessels. Para ako yun, you're, you're, you're meant to be with someone who, who's also the same romantic as romantic side as you. Yung magiging romantic yung inyong moments. Para ako kayong mga nararamdaman and you won't feel stuck. Yan. Sacking oracle card of an animal spirit, it's time for you to let go. Like a groundhog spirit. Time for you to let go. Okay? Life is speeding up kasi sabi ng antelope, so hindi mo na kailangang i-drag hanggang sa iyong kinabukasan ng iyong pinagdaanan sa nakaraan. A uh, house or house, mouse spirit means... Yes, tend to the small things. Appreciate your little ones, your dependents, your children. Appreciate the little things in your life. Your, your breathing, the air that you breathe, yung pag heart, yung pag beat ng heart mo. Yan, yung mga bagay na hindi natin pinapansin. And that's when you will realize that you're very lucky and you're very blessed like a rabbit spirit. With another tarot card. Tignan natin yan. Oh, that's you. Will, that's when you will ha be happy. Because the ten of cups is actually a sign of once you've done all those, you know, letting go, accepting the fact, knowing yourself, then you are going to experience happiness and find that person who's going to truly appreciate and love you. Na hindi ka na kailangan magdalawang isip pa. At hindi mo na kailangan to makas. You don't need to 
go ahead and find that no kasi kusa siyang darating yung dapat mo lang planuhin ang iyong kinabukasan ang iyong buhay kung paano ito magkukontinue at magkaroon ng mga magagandang investment na hindi ka manghihinayang at magkakaroon ng kasalanan or pagkakamali sa pagdidesisyon you might end up having a new love or new career a new, new plan and you just have to slow down and take your time huwag masyado magmamadali especially with your personal life and last, let's see. Oh no, it's not last. Pero pa pala isa. Ooh, fulfilling your destiny. Ba, unti-unti tayo nag-fulfill ng mga destiny. After all the grief and pain. And you being isolated. Naku, hindi ka na mag-isolate. Just me. At hindi mo na uulitin yung pagiging complacent mo before. Because you are never, never was a victim. But it was all a learning process of growth pag pagbuo ng iyong sarili pagiging better version of you ang karan man ng confusement hindi ka na unawaan ng karamihan but forgiveness is the key for you to let go and that's when you will have your enlightenment hmm? okay let's check this for more information that's what you call life for club please hindi man daw klaro ang buhay ngayon but the Lord is guiding you all throughout. Seven of diamond means it's the destiny to fulfill. And He's the one that guiding you through that path ng dapat mo lakbayin. Huwag kang kumontra sa agos ng, ng buhay ng Panginoon para hindi ka magkamali. Kahit anong sabihin sa'yo ng karamihan, they're all against you. They might end up gossip, doing gossip against you or even na hurt ng iyong pamilya because of it. But then, you know, that's part of your chapter of life should continue being a good person someone who has a great, really great heart continue your life to the fullest and even if there's a lot of battles to fight on and you might feel frustrated then your battle is not only for you but for your dependents or loved ones ang simpleng pamumuhay at kaligyahan na magdudulot sa'yo ng pagtugon sa pakikipag-usap sa Panginoon this is what we call seven of club means prayers or communicating with God. So there you go. Maraming maraming salamat sa aking mga ayan, sa aking mga pensierians. Thank you so much for all your watching and supporting me all throughout sa aking mga nagpapabook na personal private reading. Thank you, thank you so much. Sana nakapulot kayo ng aral sa aking pagliliit sa inyo. This is not only meant for pensierians, but this is also meant for those who need some advice. If you want to speak to me, just go ahead and message me on my Facebook page or Instagram. And you can also, please don't forget to subscribe. Ayan, just kung makalimutan. Kung hindi pa kayo nakaka-subscribe, please click that red button. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Click that notification para hindi kayo uh, mawala sa aking mga bagong updated videos. Like, share, and even on my Facebook page, like and share. Follow me on my Facebook page and Instagram. Marami salamat. Namaste.